This is Tekker 911, episode 14, Ubuntu. I'm J.D. Dorfman. Today we're going to show you Ubuntu Linux, which is a free and open source operating system that you can get as a live CD that you can run that does not touch your hard drive. It's a more friendly version of Linux as opposed to some of the older versions that you have to use more command line. And the motto is Ubuntu is Linux for human beings. As you may notice, uh, we're having some issues here, and that's to be expected with Ubuntu because, <laughs> yes, <laughs> because it's somewhat feature limited and it doesn't work with some hardware, but it's good on old computers, it's freeware, try it. It's just not good for doing television production. It's not made for that. It's made for people who want a watered down operating system that doesn't take up much space. Maybe throw it on an old computer that you have laying around the house. Ubuntu comes with a lot of free and open source software that's very similar to Windows programs that are proprietary. Like Mozilla Firefox to surf the internet. We all know this from episode one. OpenOffice.org, which is a lot like Microsoft Office, except once again free and open source and limited. And you can add and review, move more programs. This Ubuntu comes with this program that basically allows you to surf through. And why is this not working? There we go. I forgot to mention LICs are very slow. Depends on your CD player or drive, but it's sometimes slow and lagging but you can add like tons of these more tons more programs like BitTorrents and RSS readers and other programs to spruce up. Much like Mozilla Firefox which has tabs for internet browsing you can have multiple desktops to have different things running so you could have one with your word processing running another one where you can run Firefox and you could also have in another tab once again it's lagging you can have this program called Evolution Mail, which is kind of like Microsoft Outlook, except free and open source and a little limited. But if you don't need that much, you really don't need Outlook. It depends on how much use you're going to really need out of it. Ubuntu is also great because if you don't, if you want to actually install it on an old computer you have laying around, you can install it pretty easily, and it works pretty well. Alright, so if you had that old computer laying around the house, not doing much, you, you only wanted to check your email or go on the web, try Ubuntu, it's free, you can have them ship it out to you, it'll take a couple months though, but you should still give it a try. At Ubuntu.com, you can either ship CDs or burn your own CDs, which is, it depends on how fast you want it. And the live CD will go a little slow, but the stall is pretty good. I'm Mike Doden. I'm J.D. Dorfman. And this was Tekken 901. Try out Ubuntu. For computer help, visit Tekken, our social computer help network at tekker.net. To watch this episode again, get show notes, or get show notes, or subscribe to versions for your feed reader, both video and audio in multiple formats, visit our website at 911.tekker.net. Also on iTunes, search for Tekker in the iTunes store, and you can subscribe to versions for your iPod. Ooh, iPod. You can send us your so suggestions, feedback, and other mail at 911 at tecker.net or leave us a voicemail at 610 572 2730.